Hey everyone, it's Paul here and uh, happy holidays to you first of all. Uh, I love holiday woodworking. That's my favorite time of the year to be in the shop. I like to make projects that I can crank out, uh, make a, a good number of them to give away as gifts. Uh, and I like to make items that have a little whimsy to them uh, for, for the holidays. So this bottle opener uh, with the snowman is, uh, it checks all those boxes for me. A lot of fun to make, you can crank them out. I got this hardware kit from Rockler. Uh, it was about a $10 item and uh, threads into an insert into the, uh, into the hat. Uh, and then I, I used a chunk of bird's eye maple for the body and then I painted the hat uh, with a, just a, a matte black spray paint. So I'm just gonna walk you through this simple process that I used to make this and uh, hope you give it a shot. If you have any questions, feel free to ask down below. And without further ado, let's make some chips fly. I get started over at the bandsaw just by roughing out a blank. This is bird's eye maple from an old veneer core. Uh, and then cross cutting so I get a good squared up surface uh, for mounting on the lathe. And I'm just going to drill a pilot hole. This will be a good guide for me as I register it on the lathe and make sure I leave myself a good spot for mounting uh, the, the uh, hardware later and it will be directly exactly centered. Then just getting it spinning at uh, about 1200 RPM, rounding it out using a spindle roughing gouge. Each pass gets a little bit easier and it gets a little bit more round. Now I'm just marking my transition points where the hat is going to start and where each of the rungs of the snowman will transition. And I'm going to just remove some material using a parting tool, just getting me down to roughly the, uh, the, the uh, diameter for each of the rungs of the snowman and for the hat itself. And again, marking the transition point just to make it a little bit easier on myself as I use a spindle roughing gouge to, or a spindle gouge to uh, actually do the turning of the snowman rungs. I'm not too particular about, you know, perfect round. I want you're going to be a little bit elongated here. Uh, really, what, part of what I'm doing is is making a nice handle for the bottle opener. So I don't want it to be too big and round. This really feels nice uh, as a grip uh, for the bottle opener. Just using a pointed spindle gouge to get the detailed gouge really to get into those crevices. I like a crisp transition when I'm making a snowman. Then I just hit it with a couple coats of Mylan's Friction Polish, which is an awesome finish for spindle turning. Then drilling out with the appropriate size bit for this hardware kit and instructions are on the packaging from Rockler. Then hitting it with some matte black spray paint. Real simple process with the body masked off. Gives it a nice contrasting look. Then installing the insert and then the bottle opener itself. Really simple. Ta-da! All right, that wraps this up. Quick and simple, just like I promised. Uh, let me know if you have questions down below. I thank you for watching. Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please do so and follow me and blah, 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 all that. So thanks again for watching. Take care.